in loving memory of our beloved Leonora Dasheville of Lamar Library. We departed this life on May 18, 2013 and was laid to rest on June 6, 2013. Grandmother, it's been six months and 14 days since you've been gone and not a day goes by without a thought or memory of you. It would have been your 81st birthday yesterday and oh how we wished that you were here to celebrate it too. This November was just not the same for every year we could remember we had a gift and a card in your name. We celebrated your 80th as one but your creator needed you at 81. Today especially we remember you and relive the pain that your death put us through. You were a woman of extreme strength, courage and love, who was beautiful with a soft heart and now peaceful and free as a dove. Someone on who our admiration was built around for her womanhood, wife, friend and grandmother since she was brought onto this ground. We will always respect all you went through in your hardships and distinguished ways. Your ability to hold yourself with such dignity and pride in all your days. Grandmother, you have taken a little part of us with you as you followed your angels who have guided you to your precious place. May you look down on us with pride for you are now truly our angel of grace. You are now in your new heavenly home. May you rest in peace for which you truly deserve. You will forever be truly missed and remembered for your love and honor in which we will preserve. A thousand times we needed you, a thousand times we cried. If love alone could have saved you, you never would have died. A heart of gold stopped beating, two twinkling eyes closed to rest. God broke our hearts to prove he only took the best. Never a day goes by that you're not in our hearts and our souls. Happy birthday, grandmother. We love you always and forever. Words provided by her granddaughters.